And let's see here. Added a couple things. Got a fire. Still have the Enchi Pastel Lesser Spider. Uh, let's see, a Yellow Belly's in there. Pastel Yellow Belly. I got a Pinstripe from BHB. And then my uh, Bigger Ball Python's down here. So I'll go ahead and go through all of those. So here's my Enchi Male. Got them from Dan over at DM Exotics. Crazy little dude here. He's got a lot of nice blushing through the back. And uh, his colors are a little bit different from normal Enchis. He's a little bit, uh, I don't know, just slightly different. Nothing, I'm not saying he's some crazy Enchi or some shit, but looks cool. I like this dorsal blushing. And he's hovering at about 350 grams right now. So he'll, he should be good to go for uh, the next season. Here's my spider female, got it from BHB, she's a uh, 09, about 800 grams, loves skipping meals, but uh, she's apparently in shed right now, so she's at least gaining some weight, hopefully she'll eat uh, after she gets out of shed here, uh, I'd like her to get up to at least 1500 before I start breeding her, she got that nice high white pattern and this nice almost full stripe going down her back, there's only a couple breaks in it, so uh, Breed her to the lesser, kick out some nice lesser bees, hopefully. Here's my uh, lesser ball python. Uh, nice reduced pattern. I think it comes from uh, him being the sibling to a Mojave. Or, uh, yeah, to a Mojave in lesser breeding. So, uh, got this from a friend of mine who uh, got the Mojave. And uh, they look really similar. The Mojave's got really light reduced patterns, almost exactly the same like this lesser. So it might be... Uh, what happens when you breed them together to uh, get the Lucy's? You know, maybe the Lessers and Mojaves come out like this. Who knows? So we'll see. He's uh, 500 grams or so. Uh, likes to skip meals, so he hasn't been putting on weight like I'd like. But uh, should be go to go good to go next season with my spider and make some lesser bees. So we'll see. This is my male cinnamon pastel. He's in shed right now. He fathered the uh, clutch little sinnies. About uh, 1,300 to 1,500 grams, nice size male, and uh, probably keep him for another couple seasons, eventually sell him, who knows. So, we'll see. He's a good breeder, might try and go for the Super Cinnies again, like I said, so uh, see how he does. Here's my yellow belly female. She's looking really good. She's got these nice bright flames coming up the side, she's a really bright yellow, you know, gold tones eating like a champ. She always uh, always takes meals, hasn't refused yet. So hopefully by... Oh, geez, 2013? Seems like a long way off, but she'll get to size. Who knows? Future ivory producer, hopefully. Here's the newest snake I got. Little pinstripe female from Brian. Uh, Pretty nice little pattern to her, you know, a little busy, but uh, I like it. So a uh, couple years she should be to size, and I don't know, I haven't decided what I'm going to breed her to yet, just kind of got her, haven't had a pinstripe, figured I'd add the gene to the collection. So, nice little girl, haven't had a chance to weigh her yet either, so she's probably about 250 grams or so, so she's not too big, but not too small. Nice little uh, late 2010 or so. My cinnamon pastel female, she's probably pushing about 1,300 grams right now, uh, planning on bleeding, breeding the uh, lesser to her, and maybe the cinnamon male for some super cinnies. Uh, who knows, could also do pewters and a couple other things. So we'll see. Hopefully she can get closer to 1,800, 2,000 grams by the breeding season and get a nice size clutch out of her. Here's my uh, pastel yellow belly male, also from BHB. Uh, another 2010, hovering about 390 grams. Uh, breed him to my yellow belly when she gets to size. Hope we make some pastel ivories. 
And then also to that pastel female for some hopefully super pastel yellow bellies, which look really sick. They really uh, get more of this dorsal blushing. And uh, they just look really cool. So He uh, hasn't refused meals yet. And uh, solid grower, solid eater. Got uh, some good hopes for this guy. This is my big normal female. Uh, she laid these seven eggs. She's uh, dropped a couple clutches for me. She's probably about 2,500 grams right now. So she's been a solid eater since she's gotten back on food and uh, given her large rats. Try to get her back up to weight. Hopefully she can get up to around uh, 28 or even 3,000 grams by the next season. And push out some, uh, some more nice clutches. Alright, this is my little fire female from BHB. Nice little 2010. She's uh, about 350 grams also. Just kind of guesstimating there. I weighed them a little bit ago. And she's pretty freaking active. Really light. Nice colors to her. I'll let her go back into these hides. Here's my uh, pastel female. 66% Posset Orange Ghost. Got them from a uh, reptile show out here. One of Dan's friends from DM Exotics set up with him. So bought her. She's probably at about, I think, 560 grams, so she's well on her way. Uh, I don't think she'll hit, you know, breeding size by next year, but she'll definitely be close. And she's got these nice bright yellows going down her side. A lot of blushing on her head.